going on? It's Alexander here, back with some more Assassin's Creed Odyssey. And let's go and rejoin the priest. I believe it's up here. And then we'll come back and actually get the thing rolling. But he gives us information we need. That old priest hiding by the tree. See what he has for us. Loved more for its legend or its olives. Now, where is that priest? I thank you for your discretion, Eagle Bearer. Chrysis has many eyes and ears throughout the sanctuary. What else can you tell me about the Spartan woman and child? The woman left the child's blanket behind. We tried to return it, but it was too painful a memory for her. Where did she go? What happened to the child? So, Chrysis was right. You knew the rules, Timoxenos. You will suffer her wrath. Please, Tos. Please. Get behind me, priest. I'll deal with these two. I've had enough! Uh. You've not uh. the uh. Of your life! Huh, don't these lo those people look familiar? Well, I use the term people loosely. It's funny, whenever I was uh, in the failed recording, when I came here, I, uh... I... Uh, was wanted at the time. So, a bunch of bounty hunters showed up at the same time. Which made that really fun, you know? Was that everything? I didn't see the quest shown that it completed. Fortune. Fortune. Bandits, capers of trouble in paradise. We are about the point where we can go do that. The blind man. Try to make sure we are good, you know? Yeah, I think we're good. Let's head to the bathhouse. So we dealt with that one little annoyance. And got rid of some of the cultists. Let's see what he's up to over here, you know? I should be extra careful in this area. There we go. Guards! 
They're dead. And you must be Midon. He doesn't speak. So I've heard. I'm here to find out why. Chrysis did this to him. Uh -huh. I thought he did this to himself. To prove his loyalty to her. Now, why would Chrysis want an elder priest to cut out his tongue? Midon is a caring, generous man. I want answers from him, not you. Tell me about the Spartan woman and her baby. He can only answer yes or no. The Spartan woman, was her name Mirini? They said she had a baby with her. Was it hers? The baby was close to death when they arrived. Midon prayed for its life. You saved the child. No. He did everything he could, but the baby was badly wounded. Did she tell you where she was going? Do all sanctuary priests take their servants to bed? I am not <laughs> his servant. We share a sacred bond. A sacred? Right. I know why Chrysis made you cut out your tongue. The night my mother brought my brother here, you and your priests left him for dead. And Chrysis didn't like you telling the story. That's not what happened! What do you know? You're too young to have been there. He told me the story many times before that witch stole his voice. He tried to save the baby, did everything he could. I don't believe you. Dead? How can my baby be dead? I don't know what to tell you. You were lucky he survived as long as he did. That... that fall was devastating. <laughs> my baby! My baby! <laughs> Listen, there's nothing we can do for you anymore. You'd best be on your way. Ray is here. Uh. <laughs> They're gone. They're both gone. He wept for that Spartan woman so far from home, her baby barely recognizable, hardly breathing. Tell me, please. I need to know. Not even Apollo could save the child. Midon told me how the Spartan woman wept, held the baby in her arms, sang to him, before finally leaving him to the gods. Chrysis took the baby, didn't she? And she made you cut out your tongue to hide the truth. Where is Chrysis? There is an altar, where people offer their sick babies to be healed. This is where she took the child. Find it near the statue of Apollo Maleatas, and you'll find Chrysis. People come to this sanctuary to heal. But I come here and find people dying without hope, priests without tongues, and babies left with an insane woman. <laughs> My mother was a fool to trust any of you. I'm going to find Chrysis, and she's going to pay for what she's done. Hush, my child. May Ira and there we go. our sacred family. As you see, Chrysis is one of the members of the cult. This is the key to finding my mother. I must find this altar of Apollo Maleatas. Okay, let's see here. There's an Agilus. I believe it's right up here, if I remember correctly. And now we're about at the point that I was speaking about. You'll see what I mean when we get there. Let's go. Thankfully we can actually do something about it. Unlike most instances of this. There's the altar of Apollo. 
Not here, it's where we go from here. There's the statue of Apollo and the altar. A warning. I must be getting close. You can probably guess where this is going, considering how evil the cult is. All you cultists will die here. I'm going to beg for death. Will I, though? seems to run in your bloodline, oh mighty eagle bearer. Don't you dare speak of my family, snake. I still remember the night your mother brought me my child. The sad, pathetic thing, crying in the rain. Had I known then that Mirini had two children. But here you are. My family is complete. You let my mother believe her baby was dead. But he was. Oh, how she wept when his little heart stopped beating. But then I took care of him, placed him on this very altar, screamed for the gods to spare his life, and they listened. What did you do with my brother? I saved his life by teaching him to suffer, to know pain so well that he would learn to welcome it like an old friend. And now he will teach all of the Greek world to know that pain. You tortured him? He was just a baby. I taught him to survive. This world is cruel. It demands strength or death. So I gave him strength. Where did my mother go that night? That weakling crawled to the hills of Corinth. The monger was supposed to deliver her back to me. But she can't hide forever. She will give us more children. I'll run my spear through your throat for the pain you caused. <laughs> this world is pain. I gave Zemo strength to cope. Your mother was a weakling who whined to the gods like a pig on an altar. I am more a mother to her child than she will ever be. I can be a mother to you too, Eagle Bearer. This goes beyond my family. You and your cult are going to destroy the Greek world. You bring nothing but suffering. You talk of suffering, and yet you come drenched in blood and threaten my life. You are a killer, just like your brother. Here, let me show you. You know what cowards always do. This baby is yours? He was dying. Chrysis had me bring a gift to Ira so that he might be protected. Chrysis lit the temple on fire with the boy and me inside. Chrysis is a servant of Ira. She does what needs to be done. What needs to be done? She left your baby to burn alive. And you saved him. Gods bless you, Eagle Bearer. Sleep now, sweet child. Mater is here. I'm not sure saving that baby was the right thing to do. Chrysis's reign of terror must end. If what Chrysis said was true, Mirini believes my brother died long ago. I can't let Chrysis walk free. 
I'll kill that Malaga. That's what we will do. Into Argolis. If I'm not mistaken. I need to go, I think it's around here. I don't remember the exact place, but I think it was around there is where that coward and literal piece of trash is uh, hiding at. In fact, to make our search a little easier, let's go and get the viewpoint. Even though I knew Hab still pisses me off. <laughs> I know she's in these woods somewhere. And so somewhat close to the temple. Maybe it was here? No, she wasn't at a camp. Let me see something. Walk that way so we know... I think that's where we need to go. Okay, thank. I don't think is, there's no other quest here, right? Oh, wait. Never mind, there is. At least I hope this is the quest for it. So then get this quest started and then we'll probably do one more for this recording session. Which will basically be hunting down the priestess. I'm using air quotes there. say the forest. I thought the forests of Argos are safe. They stole our food, our horse. They wanted to take me. All I can hear is their awful laughing. Such a horrible noise. Laughing? 
And the whole group ambushed you for one horse? <laughs> yes! If your husband is facing the bandits alone, he won't have long to live. Please! I have a child! You have to help us! I will find your husband and the bandits. Alrighty. Well, we'll go deal with that in the next one. So thank y'all for watching, and I'll see you then.